Well, we're told that 36 people spoke at that public hearing, and there were plenty of valid concerns, concern also economic issues they talked about, as well as protecting Keene's image. But supporters say the positives outweigh the negatives. I don't want to be explained to some widow that her husband was shot just because it, it, uh, we didn't provide the bear cat because it didn't fit the image of Keene. Keene City Councilor Mitchell Greenwald supports the $285,000 federal grant that would buy a Lenko armored vehicle similar to one of these. In fact, the City Council already approved it, but one councilor wanted to reconsider, a move getting the support of free staters. This is all about making the police into a military force. Ian Freeman and other free staters turned their opposition into song, visiting City Hall Wednesday. Thanks, but no tanks. Thanks, but no tanks. Thank you for nothing, city bureaucrats. Thanks, but no bear cats. They've even taken the tunes to the homes and offices of city councilors and spoke out at a recent public hearing. Councilor Greenwald says a lot of misinformation is out there. Uh, we are basically getting a very stripped-down version of this. Uh, there's no battering ram, there's no tear gas canisters, there's, there's some really very bizarre things that they can equip them with. As it currently stands, no vehicle of this type exists uh, within at least about an hour, hour and a half's travel time from us. Uh, the police chief who spoke to a council committee in December told them the armored car would go beyond crime and be used as a rescue vehicle in situations like flooding. Freeman doesn't buy it. So they're not protecting anyone with this except for their own selves. And if they weren't aggressing against peaceful people so regularly, uh, like folks growing plants, for instance, then they wouldn't have so much to be afraid of. Now, the counselor who is against this vehicle is on vacation right now, so we were unable to speak with him. The full city council will be taking up this issue on March 1st. Reporting live in the newsroom, Heather Hamill, WMUR News 9. You rule by force and not by law, like Orwell's 1984. Getting an attack truck makes that clear. It's time to say no more. We won't take or give any more. That's why we're singing. Thanks, but no tanks. Thanks, but no tanks. Thank you for nothing, city bureaucrats. Thanks, but no bear cats. If you'd like to see the lyrics.